wasn't easy to do. I remember being all alone in my room and after the call I was freaked out and crying. I will never forget this moment not because it was scary but this uh, changed me for better. Hi there, this is Krina Panjal. I hope you're doing great. Today I'm really excited to share with you that I've uploaded my very first class on Skillshare. Uh, Skillshare is an online platform where creatives from different fields share their knowledge. I've been using Skillshare for the past few years and I'm using it like uh, illustrations, uh, different softwares. I'm currently learning about video editing so you can learn anything you want. Here you can find classes on software, art, productivity, designing and lot more. Here I have uploaded my very first class on acrylic landscape painting. So in my class I have shared a lot of tips and I have divided class in a bite sized lessons. So you can easily get back to any lessons again. Here you can create a beautiful landscape painting step by step with me and at the end you can upload your artwork so I can review and give you a feedback. Interesting. If you like, you can check out the link in the description below. And if you go through the link, uh, you will get one month of free access to all the Skillshare classes and you can learn anything you want. New Year is coming and we all make new resolutions. So if this year you want to learn new hobby or develop new skills, definitely go check out. This is the perfect gift for you or your loved ones where they can learn anything they want in their own speed. So definitely check out. Uh, you won't regret it for sure. And let's start today's video. Christmas is around the corner and I'm in a cafe. I'm not a coffee person but this place has amazing cranberry coffee. And seeing this, I felt why not I paint some sangria. I know it's completely different but I just had to paint that for Christmas. So this sketch will be all dedicated to our Christmas sangria. I'm using 0.3 lead pencil. I usually sketch with this only because it's really light and thin which is great for detailing and I can erase this very easily. December is like really magical time of the year. I mean this month feels magical not only because of the Christmas but it also fuels us with some different kind of force like feeling of new beginnings. Uh, this feels like we can start over. A new hope of doing something really amazing, right? I don't have to explain because we all know this amazing feeling and we know the power of new beginnings. In this one year, a lot of things have changed. I'm really changed as a person and definitely in a better way. Recently, I was uh, thinking that last year, this was the exact time I was at a completely different place. I remember being super scared as I had no idea where my life is gonna go. As most of my friends, I also decided to go to UK and get my masters. This decision was more likely what uh, everyone expected me to do. Kind of a safe plan like get masters and get a job. Growing up, I was all about art, something I truly enjoy. This makes me happy, but I was always scared to take this path as I was super scared because this path was unknown to me. No one around me has done it before and I really never thought about art being my career. So I tried to do what everyone around me was doing. But deep down, I know I wanted something else. I had already list down my universities, uh, what courses I want to take. I was preparing for my lids and one morning things just changed. I woke up early. I was sitting with my parents and out of nowhere, they asked me like, why do you want to go out? because they believed in me or something that I can do something on my own. I don't know why they told me this lot of time before and they were not 100% on board with this idea of me going out. 
we had a little discussion but don't remember whole conversation but this time this moment it just felt right something just hit hard and this time i decided i want to face my fears and do the things that i really wanted to do okay it wasn't easy as i am describing but it was way more complicated but i'm really grateful for that time which made me the person who i am right now after 2 3 days and a lot of thinking and i finally took courage and called my agency that i'm dropping off my all plans for going to uk it wasn't easy to do i remember being all alone in my room and after the call i was freaked out and crying i will never forget this moment not because it was scary but this uh, changed me for better that was the moment i decided i will do all in my control to make my art a career now i had no backup plans to fall back i just had dream and i have to work to get there i really wanted to become a surface designer and i wanted my art to be on products next day i bought a new journal for 2023 and downloaded lot of images from pinterest something i wanted to achieve in 2023 and write down my all goals i stick images of products with artworks i stick all the things that i wanted okay i'm all in for vision boards and dream boards i think everyone should do it it doesn't matter you do it digitally or be more creative but it's a great way to remind yourself about your goals I took a lot of classes on Skillshare. This really helped me in learning about art licensing, portfolio building, how can I reach out to brands and a lot more. I remember getting back from college every single day and working on my portfolio, sending countless emails to brands and getting rejections. Uh you know sometimes it feels like what am I even doing? But I had no other option, so I kept pushing myself. And finally the moment came where a brand approached me looking my work from Instagram I was completely shocked I'm like how does that even happen <laughs> they wanted to work with me uh that night I could not even sleep because of the excitement oh god I was dreaming for this day for so long When I started to look for ways how can I make this work I started to find more things that I would love earlier I didn't because uh, things were just completely out of my comfort zone I started this YouTube channel started speaking more on videos I started going out in public and sketching then I finally uploaded my very first class on Skillshare I started selling my artwork doing more commissions and there are some new things that I'm working on I'm really excited about this This year I finally took leap of faith and did things that I really wanted to do. When I think about all this, it made me realize that with every small step I have grown so much. Not just with my career but also as a person. A year ago I was extremely shy and not confident, but now I'm proud of the progress I have made. You know, sometimes we beat up ourselves for not reaching our goals, but we often forget to look back and see how far we have come. As this year is about to end, give yourself some credit and be proud of yourself for all the progress you have made this year because every step counts. Right now I feel so blessed. I am so happy where I am right now. Not all goals have been achieved, but I am proud that I listened to my heart. I wake up every single day with so much excitement that I get to do what I love for a living. I'm enjoying this journey. Definitely it's unknown and feels scary, but I don't regret it. This feels so alive. There will be wins, there will be times when I lose too. That's the beauty of following your dreams, following your heart because it will always guide you in a right path.
all i want to say is just follow your dreams do what makes you happy i know sometimes it gets really hard but just know you will always find a way do what makes you happy do what makes you feel alive because life is too short to do things that you don't love so with that i'll end this video i hope you enjoyed this video and it inspired you even a little bit thank you so much for watching this video till the end make sure you like share and comment and if you want to be part of my art journey don't forget to subscribe to my channel uh take care and i'll see you in the next video